Hi guys, welcome to Scenes Like Tracy. It's me, Tracy. I know, long time no see, right? Or at least long time for you not to see me. <laughs> Cause I haven't seen you guys either, so. <laughs> welcome to Scenes Like Tracy. Scenes Like Tracy. Uh, it is 2022 and today I just want to go over the 10 things that you can expect to see on Scenes Like Tracy and I have a list. Alright, these are 10 things that you can expect to see on Scenes Like Tracy in the year 2022. Number one, dolls. Duh! Dolls like turquoise and dolls like prints. You can expect to see more dolls on Seems Like Tracy. And not only will you see dolls, but number two, doll tutorials. Yes, I'm going to be showing you how to make some dolls. Number three, sewing. Yes, sewing, like regular sewing. Regular sewing. I haven't sewn in so long, so you can sew along with me and we can both make mistakes. <laughs> it's gonna be tons of fun. Uh, so we're gonna do some sewing, but also uh, number four is sewing tutorials and sew alongs. I guess it could kind of still, still be the same as sewing, but sewing tutorials and sew alongs. I think that's gonna be so much fun. <laughs> All right, number five is gonna be tools. Oh, of course, I gotta talk about tools. Tools I use in doll making and tools I use in sewing. I'm a tool kind of girl. I love tools. Give me a Dremel. <laughs> Give me, you know, any kind of tool that I can use to make my life easier. I'm gonna use it and I love sharing that stuff with you. Homemade tools, I got you. Okay, number six, Cricut. We are going to be using Cricut. Yes, sirree, Bob. Yes, sirree. I got a lot of Cricut ideas in my head, and I am going to be using my Cricut, and I'm also going to be showing you how to use your Cricut. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm obsessed with this Cricut now. I have figured out so much stuff on it, and I love it. And as you can see, seems like Tracy. Oh, I'm going to be sharing Cricut stuff that I've made. Uh, I'm gonna do a little Cricut tutorials. So I just group Cricut all as one big thing. That is number six. Uh, number seven, art. Da, 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 da. Art, my art, of course. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be sharing things that I've made and things that I'm in the process of creating. I used to be a painter. Not a great painter, but I was a painter. And I love making art. And this is called Melanin Explosion. If you're interested in the print, just let me know and I can get you the print. I have the original uh, painting. So, uh, but if you're interested in the print, this is called Melanin Explosion. And this was made around the time uh, when George Floyd was killed. And I just had so much rage in my head and I just created a piece that expressed how I felt. So that's called Melanie Explosion. Let me know if you want the print. Just DM, uh, leave me a message below. And let's see. I probably have lost count now. Oh, we're going to talk about my workspace. Don't know if you can see all this loveliness behind you. I have me a sewing station. I have me a, a station for cutting. I have a Cricut station. And I just have some computer and more Cricut station. <laughs> So it's gonna be fun and I'll go over organization and how I have things set up. And uh, so that will be great. Let's see, oh, I don't know if this is number nine or number 10, but it's gonna be bargains, bargains and more bargains. Hello, I love a good bargain. I do, I love a good bargain. Anybody who knows me will tell you, I get so happy when I can get a good deal on things. And whether that be sewing tools, fabric, patterns, just if there is a discount, if I can find it and it's something uh, that's that's good that I can use, 
I'm going to use it because I like to pass those costs on to my customers. I want to be able to use expensive things without paying the expensive price so that my customers can have nice things without me having spent a fortune to get those things. So yeah, I am a bargain girl. That's probably my number one thing. I love to get a good deal and I don't and there's no shame in my game. I am willing to pay less for a valuable piece of something. So that's going to be it. All right, I can't remember if that was nine or 10, but I'm gonna go into some unofficial stuff, which you can expect to see on Seems Like Tracy. And uh, one thing is hair. <laughs> Look, this is just unofficial. You're gonna see me come on here some days, I'm gonna have this hair. Some days I'm gonna have a teeny afro. Some days I might have some locks. And some days I just be natural or maybe even straight so my hair is going to change please don't get all upset if you come here one day and i look totally different that's just me it's my prerogative and i'm going to do it so and i love changing up my hair because who wants to look the same every single day ah, I yawn. <laughs> so yeah hair is one of those unofficial things that is going to be you're going to see on seems like tracy in 2022 oh and the other thing is glasses Oh my lord, yes, glasses. I always have plenty of glasses. You will see me with no glasses. You will see me with some glasses. And you will see me with other glasses because honestly, I am blind as a bat and I need as many readers as possible. And I have them in all different strengths depending on what I'm doing. I have some that I use specifically when I'm hand sewing. I have some that I use when I'm sitting on my sewing machine. I have some that I use when I'm cutting. I have some that I use when I'm on the computer. It just depends. And I found these were so cute. Of course, I gotta be cute with my readers. I gotta get me some nice little cute ones, yay. So yeah, you will see that. And uh, let me see what was, else was unofficial. Oh, humor. You might have figured this out already, but you know, I try to be a little bit funny for you. Uh, just to keep it light, um, hello. Life is already hard as heck. You don't need to come here and watch me and be depressed when you leave. I want you to smile, I want you to be happy. So, you know, come on in and sit with me. If I start getting on your nerves, you can always leave. That's the best thing about YouTube. It's like you can watch as much as you want. You can be like, I am sick of her, and you can leave. But if you just want to hang out with a nerdy old mom, which is me, um, you know, you guys are welcome. I'm going to spread as much peace, love, and hair grease as I can on this channel. <laughs> so, <laughs> all right, let's see what else. Uh, unofficial. I don't even know just stuff 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 I'm doing stuff I have stuff I made stuff I'm wearing ah, loving my cricket shirt y'all don't know how obsessed I am with this cricket and this iron-on and vinyl and infusible fabric what have they done they've created a monster I'm gonna be doing cricket stuff all the time and I gotta make sure I still do doll stuff so anyway those are the 10 things that you can expect to see on Seems Like Tracy in 2022. What you gonna do in 2022? I did say I would stop dancing. So thank you guys for watching my channel. Please like and subscribe and tell a friend. And I look forward to seeing you this year in 2022. Hey, hey, hey. 2022, what you gonna do? 2022, what you gonna do? Hey, 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 hey. All right, all right, okay. I promise I'll stop dancing. But it's 2022! <laughs> oh, and uh, just to let you guys know, I had my wisdom tooth pulled about three or four days ago, and so my jaw's still a little bit swollen, and side of my face still hurts so if I look a little different or if I sound a little different uh that's what it is